Hello. Right, I'm not sure this is quite working, so I'm going to send you over a new new um, new link. Hold on. Can I take some of these things through to the playroom? Yeah, you're alive now, by the way. Huh? You're, you're online live. With, you're speaking live to the world. That's embarrassing. Just waiting to see if people have arrived. Uh, Martin's here. Good in the chat. I'm just going to reply to you, Martin. Just having a little bit of a Alice move around. Uh, we'll just wait for a few other people to turn up. And then I'll run through the teams, uh, talk to you about how it's going to work this evening. Um, and obviously you guys can keep up to date with each other on the chat. Uh, hopefully there'll be a few other people turn up. Um, I know Adam's just logged in. So hopefully in a second, you'll have a few more people, Martin, to sort of give some stick to. I'm sure Meats will be on in a minute. Um, and if you've got any questions during the stream, you can pop them on the chat and I'll see what I can do. I'll just hang on for a few minutes to see whether people have arrived. Well, I've got Adam on the messaging being rude. Adam, pop something in the chat. Oh, there he is. Well, I might. Right, while we're waiting for the other guys, um, I'm just going to give you the team benches um, because I know some of you have got some major problems going on in terms of your starting 11. So let me just give you the benches uh, as they are. So on the bench for in the first game, Blackburn and Leicester. Uh, Bolton have got Ostenstadt, Phelan, Mark Hughes, Michael Cole and Gordon Greer on the bench. Uh, and Leicester, Matt Jones, Ian Walker, Trevor Benjamin, Jonathan Stevenson and Brett Darby. Thanks, Adam. I agree. Um, Darby have got uh, Marvin Robinson, Andy Oakes, Paul Bertine, Andy Murray, Danny Higginbottom. And Borough have got uh, Paul Ocon, Mark Crossley, Nemeth, Dean Windass, and Colin Cooper. Uh, Everton against Villa. Uh, Everton's bench, Pistoni, Simonson, Hibbert, Clark, and Unsworth. Uh, Villa's bench, Vassell, Enkelman, Cashlul, Danny Jackman, and Mustafa Hadji. Bad players. Uh, Fulham, Newcastle. Andy Melville, Mike Taylor, Biani Goldback, Ledrinsky, and Barry Hales. And Newcastle have got Wayne Quinn, Steve Harper, Gary Speed, uh, Shola Amiobi, and Lamana Luwalua. Shola Amiobi, Martin, is he still doing the rounds at Bolton? Or is that Sammy? I reckon Shola could still do a job. Uh, right, let's carry on. Uh, Ipswich Saints. Um, we've got Logan, Marshall, Armstrong, Naylor, and Parata for Ipswich. Letizia, Moss, Benali, Taha, and The Beat. For Southampton. Uh, United against Bolton. Um, uh, oh no, sorry, Giggs is starting. Scholes, Carroll, Gary Neville, Andy Cole, Nicky Butt, uh, and Bolton's bench Ricardo Gardner, Steve Banks, Bo Hansen, Pear Franson, Paul Warhurst. 
A couple more to go. Sunderland, Arsenal, um, Medina, Macho, McCartney, Craddock and Nard Quinn for Sunderland. Tavaridis, David Seaman, Burkamp, Martin Keown and Francis Jeffers for Arsenal. And Spurs, Liverpool. Um, Spurs have got Ledley King, Casey Keller, Matthew Everington, Tariko, Simon Davis on the bench. Liverpool, Heskey, Kirkland, Yari Lippmanen, Deep, uh, Deepmar Harman and Danny Murphy. And I think one more game. Yeah, one more game. Uh, West Ham, who's uh, I'm managing and I'm on holiday at the moment, so God knows who's in charge there. Don Hutchinson, TT Camera, Jermaine Defoe, Paul Kitson, David James. And Leeds, Dominic Matteo, Paul Robinson, Stephen McFarl, Alan Smith and Eric Backer. Right, I'm just going to see whether... Hold on. Right, hold on a second. Is Meets Meets has sent me a message? Meets, are you in the chat? And then I'm going to get, and then I'm going to go for it. Then we're just going to start. Um, so basically, what's going to happen is I'm going to start the sim. It's going to work on about times two, but obviously it will be slightly delayed depending on um, whether there's been a goal or whether what's going on. Uh, I'll keep you up to date. Um, good luck to all teams. Um, I'm just going to wait for Meets to see if he can respond to this. Me says he doesn't know how to do the chat. Can someone on the chat write down how you get on the chat? Please. Adam or Martin. Hello, Jackson. Martin, get tech, can you take say to me about or Adam say how to meet how you can get on the chat and I'll pass the message on to him. Hold on, Meeks. Meeks, can you hear me on here? Reply on reply on WhatsApp if you can hear me on here. Okay. You got that? Just click on the second link, Meeks. I can hit good. Meeks, have you got this info? Scroll down. <laughs> Scroll down. Scroll is the right word, Adam, if that's what you're looking for. Scroll down. Uh, for the love. Right, mates, we're going to make a start. I reckon you can probably find it. Um, otherwise, we'll be here all night. Right, hold on a second. Let me just get the technology up and running. Okay, so like I said, we're going to operate on a double quick speed. Uh, so uh, hopefully the stream will be finished in um, obviously less than the 90 minutes because that will be dull for everyone. Okay, kick off all around the grounds. We're off. Time is on. So Bradford says he's struggling for players. Uh, Martin and Adam, how are, you, how are your teams looking? Any... Uh, any joy on the starting lineups? That's right, we're off. <laughs> we are off, Adam. How's your starting lineup? Have you got everyone playing? Hold on. Goal. We've got our first, our first goal, three minutes in, and it's come. It has come at Upton Park, West Ham Leeds. Not a good start for my holiday manager. Goal for Leeds, goal scorer, Mark Viduka, assist, Lee Boyer. First goal in the history of Championship Manager Fantasy Football. Four minutes gone. Mark Viduka. Any good for anyone? Yes, I like that. Keep that going down the side because then when Meets finally wakes up with the strip with the chat, he'll be able to see how he scored. And if anyone comes online, that's good, Adam. Yeah, like it. So, yeah, if you want to chuck the assist on there as well in the brackets. Um, yes, this was Lee Bowyer. 
four minutes. <laughs> See if Meese has had any more joy with the chat. And where is Bradford? Okay, seven minutes gone on the games. Oh, there's another. There is another goal at Upton Park. Hold on. I'm just going to get confirmation. Anyone got any Leeds players? Yeah, that's right, Adam. But a second goal. And I think I've definitely seen his, his name in some teams. Goal scorer, Harry Kuehl. Assist again, Lee Bowyer. Eight minutes gone, two nil leads at West Ham. Early nightmare for me. I'm not actually sure what happens if my holiday manager gets the sack, whether or not I get kicked out of the game. I don't think so. I might have to take the reins midweek or something to see if I can stay the ship. But looking at that West Ham team, it doesn't look particularly strong. Leeds, though, like I said to you guys in the in the Zoom meetings, um, very, very, yeah, cheers, Adam. Very strong. Like, um, they're obviously in the Champions League at the moment. Um, sort of the, I suppose you're getting towards the end of the David O'Leary era. Um, some really good players. And yeah, we're definitely a team. I mean, obviously, if you've not got them in this week, but definitely a team to keep an eye on. Normally pretty crap away from home as well in the other games. So this is a really good start for them at Upton Park. All right, this, hold on a second. This is going to be a popular goal. We've had a goal, two goals, two quick fire goals. Okay, first one, goal at the Stadium of Light, 12 minutes gone. Sunderland nil, Arsenal one, goal scorer. Thierry Henry, assist. Giovanni Van Bronckhorst, 1-0 Arsenal. I think someone's got Henry as captain. Just double check. And... The other goal that's gone in pretty much at the same time has gone in at the home of football, Old Trafford. He's gone to Manchester United. Goal scorer, Ruud van Nistelrooy. Assist, Ryan Giggs. I think there's a team that's got both of those players in. Um, I have to have a check on the phone, but there's goals flying in left, right and centre. Um, 13 minutes gone at Old Trafford and Ruud van Nistelrooy has given... Manchester United the lead against Bolton. Sorry, Martin. Uh, Ruben Estroy, Ryan Giggs with the assist. Popular goal, I think, for some of the teams. Meets, are you having any joy on the chat? Meets, get on the chat. I can't, I cannot keep flicking to the phone because there's another goal. Another goal, another goal at Old Trafford. I don't know if anyone's got him. He was expensive. Um, goal scorer, Juan Sebastian Veron. No assist. Assist for, no, for none. So there's going to be quite a lot of those this season. 15 minutes gone. 2-0 um, Manchester United. Martin, I hope if you've got any Bolton players, they're on the bench. Certainly defenders at the moment. I'm just trying to help you out, Meets, on this chat thing. Um, Depends on what you can see on your screen. I mean, this for me, I can just see me and then I can see the chat scrolling down the side. There must be a way where you can join the chat. Um, is there like a, um, a little sort of triple dot button at the top right or something that you can get on? If not, we sort it out for next week, mate, if you can't get on, because it'd be nice to have you on the chat as well. So obviously with Martin and Adam, it's good for me because I can just see the sides. I can't see the goal. Another goal gone in. I can only see this. Um, goal at Goodison Park 18 minutes goal scorer Scott Gemmell and assist no one so another assist for none goal scorer Scott Gemmell 1-0 Everton they're playing Aston Villa 1-0 Everton so quite a lot of early goals gone in about 20 minutes gone in the sim at the moment so I think it's actually working pretty quickly Cheers, Adam, for doing the scroll as well. Meeks, can you see the? Can you not see any of the chat at all on your end?
there must be there must be a simple way mate to get it on it's got to be as long as you can hear me though anyone anyone got a uh, ruvan are you have have you got a brand story mates <laughs> rude oh got another goal coming in uh 22 minutes gone jesus another goal at upton park goal scorer this time he's already got an assist to his name or two assists to his name goal scorer this time is lee Boyer. robbie keen with the assist I'm not sure if Robbie Keane was floating around some teams as well. But that is now West Ham nil, Leeds 3. 22 minutes gone. Robbie Keane with the assist. Lee Bowyer with the goal. Yeah, Robbie Keane, decent player in the game. i tell you who is good as well is Alan Smith. But he doesn't really get the minutes when Viduka's in the team. Viduka, unless he's injured, tends to be pretty much a mainstay of Leeds and scores the, the uh, you know, a lot of goals as well. A bit cheaper as well than Henri and Van Nistelrooy. And we've got our first goal at Craven Cottage. When I looked at the sim, actually, I thought this was this had a few goals in it, this game. Um, I think he was in a team. It's it's 1-0 Newcastle. Um, goal scorer, Craig Bellamy. And that's been assisted by, uh, I'm not sure about his first name, someone, Besedis. I think he's the most expensive Newcastle midfielder. Um I want to say maybe Christian Besedas. I'm not entirely sure, but he um, he cost Lucas a lot of money and didn't really do anything. I don't think in real life, but he has on the sim. Um, so yeah, 24 minutes gone. Um, Fulham nil, Newcastle one. Christian Besedas with the assist. Craig Bellamy with the goal. And there's been an injury, an early injury at the lane. Jamie Redknapp has gone off injured. And he's being replaced by Dietmar Harman for Liverpool. So 25 minutes gone, Liverpool uh, with an early injury blow. What a shame. Um, let's hope that they lose every game in this. Um, Dietmar Harman is on for Jamie Redknapp. Oh. Alice is in the room being rude. Oh, Adam, you've got Jamie Redknapp in your team. You get one point, at least he took, took part. I'm, a, I'm, actually, a, I'm actually live. Yeah, I'm actually doing a stream. Your friends know you've got no trousers on. The shorts are on, thank you. Another injury, uh, 30 minutes gone. Um, Matt Elliott has gone off injured for Leicester. They're currently nil-nil at Blackburn. Um, so if you were on for a potential clean sheet with Matt Elliott, I don't know if anyone's got him. Loves a goal, Matt Elliott as well, and a red card. Uh, he's gone off injured for Leicester. Bit of a quiet time actually in the game. The game's gone quite quickly on this side. Now, this 34 minutes gone, there's another injury at the lane. Michael Owen has gone off injured. 34 minutes gone. Yari Lippmanen is on in his place. Um, I think Michael Owen was in a team, definitely at least one team. Um, the way they do it on the sim as well is the players do have injury um, proneness as well, I think, in terms of their rating and i think michael owen's quite high uh, there's a few as kieran dyer as well i think he's noticeably quite high um equalizer for fulham john collins has equalizer fulham that's fulham one newcastle one assist from someone called wadu i don't even know if he was on the actual player list i've never heard of him before uh, but he's got the assist o u a d d o u um but john collins is the scorer of the fulham equalizer
another goal at Craven Cottage. Um, Christian Besedis has given Newcastle the lead again. So it's now 2-1 to Newcastle and assist was none. And there's been a third goal at Old Trafford. Goal scorer. Yeah, that's right. Goal scorer. Greatest player in the Premier League history. Roy Keane. Assisted by Ryan Giggs. That's Ryan Giggs' second assist of the game. If anyone's got Giggs, that is already a six-point return with two assists in 39 minutes gone that one 39 minutes gone the united goal 38 minutes gone for the fulham goal sorry about the noise in the background yeah besides yeah non non for besides no assist for that goal um and roy Keane has made it three nil to manchester united against bolton uh getting quite close to half time now um yep Giggsy. i think i think someone's got ryan Giggs. i'm just gonna have a quick look um let's have a little look Giggs. i'm sure he was in a team yeah there he is he's in martin's team martin massingiri with Giggs and van nistelrooy in his side um, so he's made a really good start. He's got Jamie Redknapp uh, as well, but a really good start. Um, oh, sorry, I've been missing out here. Another goal at Craven Cottage. Um, again, I'm not sure about the first. I'm going to go with Martin Stolzers has scored and made it 2-2. Uh, goal assist from Steve Marley. Uh, Steve Marley massively under the radar in this game. He's, I think he's maybe... Um, Six and a half million. Um, really decent player for Fulham. Scores a lot of goals. He's pretty much their go-to guy up front. Uh, and then it sort of rotates with Luis Bermorte and um, Louis Saha, who's young in this game, um, who rotate up front for Fulham. But Steve Marley is your go-to guy. So he has assisted for Stolzers to equalise. And just before half-time, there has been a fourth goal at Old Trafford. Goal scorer Dwight York, 45 minutes. Another assist for Ryan Giggs, 45 minutes gone. And at Upton Park, Trevor Sinclair has gone off and has been replaced by Don Hutchinson. That's the guy in charge of my team whilst I'm on holiday. Yeah, assist for Stolzers was Steve Marley. Uh, Marlette is, is how you pronounce it. But yes, yeah, French dude. Um, but didn't do hugely well, I don't think. In um, I don't think he did that well in England. I, I can't really remember him hugely. I do remember him playing for Fulham, but I don't remember him scoring a huge amount of goals. But I think he's pretty decent in this game. So Fulham love a goal. They do. They love a goal. Um, but you're just trying to pick on who it is. So half time. Um, Blackburn nil, Leicester nil, Derby nil, Borough nil, Ipswich nil, Saints nil, Everton one, Villa nil, Fulham two, Newcastle two, Bolton four, uh, sorry, Man U four, Bolton nil, um, Sunderland nil, Arsenal one, that's Henri, Tottenham nil, Liverpool nil, but Liverpool have lost two players in that first half through injury, and West Ham nil, Leeds three at half time. Adam, you're doing a great job on there, mate. Great job. It's just a shame that we haven't got everyone online, but I might be able to redo it at a time, maybe where the kids are in bed. Um, next Saturday might go for a little bit later if we're all still on lockdown. Um, and also if they get meets on the chat as well, rather than being virtual on the phone. Um, but I'm just going to keep running it, mate. I'm just going to keep running it and see if we can complete this. Um, as soon as you can meet are you still are you still online in terms of on the phone and i'll click for second half i hope so well you would know mate because um adam's just put on there just replying to his group thing um i hope people can still see the chat because uh, obviously, for me, it's quite hard to do it if I haven't got people contributing on the side. 
um because actually a little bit of banter sort of passes the time on the sim as well although that's been pretty quick that half um so yeah if people can get on then maybe we can try and find a time where yeah gigsy that's right that's it it's good so i can respond to those as well martin gigs with three assists um i'm just going to click at half time as well just to make sure we have any subs can't see any at the moment sometimes it doesn't update right let's 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 kick on second half okay we're off off and running second half no you don't have to worry about being mute mate it's fine like i said we'll maybe try and do a time where it's a little bit later um and the kids are in bed i just wanted to do it at a time tonight where i wasn't going to sort of impinge on mine and alice's evening because obviously this is taking quite a lot of time out of my general life with her um and she's been really good about it in all seriousness so i didn't want to do it too late because we've got some sort of quiz with her family later on um which is cool and i didn't want it to sort of take over the whole evening but if we can it definitely will work if we can get more people on um be much more sort of a uh, two-way experience so no you don't have to apologize mate and say good night to jackson um adam's doing a great job on this on the side anyway and i know meeks is watching just in terms of trying to get everyone on the chat that would be great um so yeah we'll we'll maybe we'll touch base on the um on the whatsapp um and we'll come back to that in a minute uh david batty's gone off injured for leeds um and there is a goal at white Hart lane 48 minutes gone uh, the two subs have combined for liverpool goal scorer yari Lipmanen, and he's assisted by deep mahaman so tottenham nil liverpool won never good even on a simulation for liverpool to score um yeah but they've taken the lead at the lane um i don't remember seeing anyone with yari Lipmanen or deep mahaman um you do in this game get some random midfielders um who pop in with goals like roy king's obviously scored only in his early days at united he scored a few goals it tended to dry up play a bit deeper but in this game he still cracks them in um a man Igor Bishkan as well for Liverpool awful footballer but he he scores some goals from time to time and speaking of Roy Keane he has on the 52nd minute he has just got his second goal second goal for Manchester United fifth goal in total and has been assisted by not Ryan Giggs this time Juan Sebastian Veron so goal and an assist for Veron owners already. I don't know if there was any of them, but he is worth the money if you've got it. Um, he started off his United career really well anyway in real life, and then it all went a little bit tits up for him. But he generally, um, well, in this game, he's just joined from, I think he's joined from Palmer. Palmer really strong in this game, um, and he is a really good player to have. United are 5-0 up now against Bolton. Um yeah, Roy Keane with his second, um, and Juan Sebastian Veron, 52nd minute, is the assister. Ryan Giggs has been subbed as well. So, typical championship manager, three assists, no injury. He's just been subbed. Um, it's been replaced by Paul Scholes. Paul Scholes has now come onto the pitch for Manchester United. And a change at Arsenal, uh, Nwanku Kanu has been replaced by Francis Jeffers. Um, and Arsenal still hold a slender lead at the Stadium of Light. 54 minutes gone in the game. Yeah, so Martin, I mean, even though you Giggs has gone off, um, I'd imagine that he's got to be in the running for three bonus points, three assists. You'll only get one point for your um, appearance, and you won't get a clean sheet point if they hold on. But it's still a really good return potentially it could be 13 points for gigs um obviously don't know about the bonus points yet but we'll just have to see but a really good performance for him um there is a penalty at tottenham penalty to tottenham hold on a second darren anderton will take it it's been a foul on gus poyet just waiting to find out goal is scored goal scorer Darren Anderton for Spurs. Um, 
assisted, uh, got brought down in the area. Gus Poyer got brought down. That makes it 1-1. One, one. Clean sheet wipeout for Liverpool. Uh, one all Tottenham against Liverpool at the lane. And there is another... I did say this, this game might have some goals in it. There is another goal at Craven Cottage. And two of the players we were talking about, or I was talking about a little bit earlier, um, Luis Boamorte has assisted King Luis Saha for the goal. That is now 3-2 Fulham, 57 minutes gone. Uh, goal scorer Luis Saha, assisted by Luis Boamorte. And there is a delth of subs that I need to talk to you about as well. Uh, hold on a second. Um... We've got uh, unlucky for owners of Steve Watson. I think I did see a Steve Watson floating around. He's been subbed off in the 59th minute for Tony Hibbert. So Watson owners, if they do keep a clean sheet, you won't get the points. Um, Robbie Fowler is off for Liverpool. 60 minutes. Emil Heskey is on. Steed Malbronk is off. Bjarne Goldback is on. 58 minutes. Um, and yeah, we've done the gigs. Gigs is off, like I said, for Scolzi. I think that's right. Yeah. Okay, we're into the last half an hour now, boys. Last half an hour. So, yeah, if we can... Um, if people can see this stream afterwards um, and you've looked it through, I won't put any of the scores on until a little bit later because I know some of you might want to watch this or might be watching this after um, sort of in retrospect. So you won't want to know the scores and then I'll pop on the bonus points later after the quiz. Um, don't touch your sheets until the morning because I'm going to have to have time to actually get the points on, update the league table and then reset your team. So yeah, please don't touch your... Oh dear, no, not <laughs> at least you get your two assist. I'm sorry, your two appearance points for Fowler, Adam. Yeah, um, I mean, with Owen off injured, I don't know how bad his injury is. I'll be able to update you with that before the midweek games. But you know, Liverpool got a lot of blanks. You know, it's a bit of a risk taking Robbie Fowler on, I suppose. But you know, you can. I'm sure he'll score some goals this season. Uh, same with Michael Owen, as long as he's not out for the rest of his life. Um, but yeah, he's a little bit unlucky, I suppose, two Liverpool injuries. Um, oh, we've got a breakthrough. Breakthrough at, where are we? Portman Park? Portman Road, sorry, not Portman Park. Portman Road. Um, goal scorer, Matt Holland. Uh, the assist is from Alan Armstrong. I think it's Alan Armstrong. Just says Armstrong, but I think he's Alan Armstrong at this time. So that is 1-0 to Ipswich against Southampton. Um, Ipswich, like I said to you on the Zoom, decent, really decent team. A um, lot of lot of sort of under-the-radar players. Um, I know Wado's got Titus Bramble in his team, and I think he's named him after, after you know, King Titus. But actually, in all seriousness, not a bad pick. I said to you, I think on Zoom, Horidas and decent. Jamie Clapham, if he plays, is good. I think they've got some other random guy at centre back as well. And Sereni, the goalie, decent at home, Ipswich. So, yeah, that's Matt Holland. Yep, yeah, that's it. Cheers, Adam. Yep, yeah, goal four. That was 64th minute. Um, game's going fast now. So, there's not much happening at West Ham, which is good for my holiday manager. Um, and we're almost into the 70th minute. Uh, so, midweek, what will happen is I'm not going to stream midweek as well because it would take too long. So what I'll do midweek is on the on the phones, I will just message through when the goals and the assists are happening um, over like a 90 minute or however long this takes period. Um, and then I'll try and stream next weekend again, whatever game it will be in, maybe game week four by then. Um, and then we'll try and find a time. Try and find it. Paul Merson's gone off injured. Paul Merson's gone off injured. I cannot see who they brought on without flicking through a few pages. Um, so for Villa, the Magic Man is off, 73 minutes injured. The other thing I'm expecting is quite a few goals towards the end because they do love it in the sim. There's a few random late goals. Um, 
it's gone quite quiet really in some of the games. Um, so yeah, injured Merson, that's right. Um, having said that, we have just had another goal and it's another goal at the cottage. Louis Saha again. And this time it's assisted by John Collins. So it's now Fulham four. I think that's right, isn't it? Fulham four, Newcastle two. Um, which score do you want, mate? Which score do you want? Do you want all the scores? I can give you an update on all the scores if you want. I'll have to be quick, though, because the game's still simming. Bolton are still losing 5 0. Which game? All scores. Uh, right, okay. Uh, Blackburn Leicester's 0 0. Derby Middlesbrough's 0 0. Ipswich have gone 1 0 up against Southampton. Everton is 1 0 against Villa. Fulham 4 2 up on Newcastle. Man, you are being bottom 5 0. Sunderland 0. Arsenal 1. <laughs> yeah, Bolton are shite. Uh, Tottenham are just drawn. Oh, no, hold on. I'll come back to that in a second. West Ham nil leads three. And there's been a third goal at the lane. And it's Dietmar Harman has scored the goal. Stephen G Force Gerard with the assist. I'm sure Meats has got Gerard. Yeah, I'd be very disappointed if he didn't. And he should really have the armband on him. Um yeah, G Force with the assist. Dietmar Harman with the goal. That is now Spurs one, Liverpool two, Martin. That is all the scores, mate. Do you need anything else? Oh, you got them all now, mate. No props, mate. No props at all. Uh, right, into the last 10 minutes. Um, I mean, I it's difficult to tell with, like I said, you don't know what's going on. But sometimes as well in this game, when teams go miles up, they sometimes take their foot off the gas. So I wouldn't be surprised if there weren't any more goals at Man U. Um, could, or maybe maybe even at West Ham, the Leeds might be cruising second half. Um, we have got another goal here, though, 84th minute. Newcastle have scored. Rob Lee. Um, amazing that Newcastle can score three goals and no Shearer involvement. Uh, assist for none. So no assist for 84th minute. Rob Lee um, has made it 4-3 to Fulham. 84th minute. And second goal for Everton. Kevin Campbell um, has assist none. Kevin Campbell has made it 2-0 to Everton. Um, against Aston Villa. So that looks like it's wrapped up the points for Everton. Uh, there's only five minutes to go. Um, yeah, so no assists for the Rob Lee goal and the Kevin Campbell goal. Um, so, yeah, sometimes in the in the sim, when a team goes miles ahead, um, the teams, it, it puts it on the, on the thing that teams have taken their foot off the gas or something similar to that, and they sort of go into cruise control. Uh, but yeah, Kevin Campbell um, has made that 2 0. 89th minute. Are we going to get any late goals? Ma massive goal. Massive goal at the Stadium of Light. Equaliser. Clean sheet wipeout for any Arsenal clean sheet. Any defenders. Goal scorer, Kevin the Dog Phillips. And the assist, Lillian Lasland. One all. 90th minute equaliser, Kevin Phillips. Wenger will be doing his nut. And there's been another goal at Craven Cottage. And it's that weird guy again who scored the goal, Wadu, Wada, or whatever his name is. I need to check if he's actually on the game. I, I literally have never heard of him before. Uh, and assist, John Collins. Two 90th minute goals there. Kevin the dog, yeah, assisted by Lillian Lasland. And that Wadu guy again, Wada, has scored for Fulham and John Collins with the assist. And that is 5 3 to Fulham. And that is full time, guys. Full time. So Blackburn nil, Leicester nil, Derby nil, Middlesbrough nil. Any defenders from those teams? Great returns. Ipswich 1, Southampton 0. Again, 
you needed to have an Ipswich defender in. Hopefully you did listen on the Zoom and you got someone in because they are decent. Everton beat Villa 2-0. Uh, unlucky for Steve Watson owners. And I think there was someone with Steve Watson. Um, Fulham 5, Newcastle 3. No Shearer involvement. Uh, Craig Bellamy, I think, got an assist eight maybe earlier. Uh, Fulham, Louis Saha got a couple. Uh, John Collins had a good day, I think. Um, United beat Bolton 5-0. Um, shared the goals around. Double for Roy Keane. Uh, Giggsy with three assists. 1-1 one, one at Stadium of Light. Um which was, I think, Henri scored, so good for captains, probably be in the bonus as well. Um, but obviously disappointed for a lot of Arsenal defenders. I saw, you know, there was a few Sol Campbells around, Ashley Cole, people like that. Um, but Arsenal were decent in this game, so and Sunderland's a hard place to go. Um, Tottenham uh, lost at home to Liverpool, 2-1. When well, I meet and Geo, the Liverpool fans. Um, yeah, Liverpool pretty crap, but... They've got two, I think got two blanks now, Liverpool, but that's a good result. But lost a couple of players. And uh, my boys, West Ham, um, under their stewardship, have lost 3 0 to Leeds. Good day for Lee Bowyer, um, in particular, I think, for Leeds. Um, right, guys, that's me done. Adam, thanks for the, the thing up the side, mate. Um, the rest of them who've not got on here, we'll try and sort that out for next week. Um, yeah, but thanks. I hope you enjoyed it. Took a lot of time and effort to get it done. Uh, hopefully they'll be able to recover the stream. Uh, appreciate it, mate. Um, Adam doing all the sides. Um, and I'll see you boys very soon. Okay, cheers.